I believe this to be the reason behind the delay in the pylon. And I also outline what the Pioneer's community may do to expedite the launch process. As always, this video will be short and to the point. Now, before we go any further, just remember to subscribe to this channel and to like and share it. This will facilitate the video's larger audience reach. Returning to the subject at hand, I've been receiving a lot of emails from pioneers informing me that they haven't received an invitation to complete their Chi-C or verification. Some have applied, but they have not yet been accepted or their verification is still pending. Every concern about KAIS, including these, has been reported. You can be guaranteed that every pioneer will complete their KAIC. Please be patient with those who are still awaiting KAIC. Everyone will get their KAIC in due course. Please be patient, as this procedure takes a while because it is being validated manually. Pioneers can eventually shift their Pi balance to main by using KAIC to authenticate themselves. A distinct, decentralized method is used by the KAIC solution. The method combines human verification with machine automation to provide accurate and effective kike, accurate and effective kike for all parties. In actuality, there are more than 47 million active pioneers in the world, globally and with a small number of validators. The cause. The idea of employing pioneers to help verify other pioneers in their respective locations was investigated by the core team. The CHI-C procedure will take time, and it appears that it will be the deciding factor in the PyCoin's formal introduction. We will get closer to the launch date. When we can use our Pi currency officially, the sooner they finish the CHI process. During this time, the core team is also organizing and releasing. The roadmap has two versions. The project's roadmap will keep pioneers informed about every stage involved in opening mainnet. Attendee hackathons have been funded by the Pi Core team, one of the main team's initiatives to develop Pi's infrastructure and utilities during the currently closed network phase is this outreach, which aims to inform eager builders about Pi platforms, attract and onboard the next generation of developers to assist in realizing Pi's vision and introduce the Pi network to creative young developers. For the cryptocurrency of the future, the network will continue to operate until a sufficient number of pioneers complete KIC. Stay inside the secured mainnet. You can now relax knowing that you will get the opportunity to kike, but it may take some time. Use this to your advantage by mining more coins and accumulating more. Keep going. We're nearly there. To get the project where we want it to go faster, pioneers can also help. Applying to be a Kike fee validator is how you accomplish this. If you've received confirmation, who is the Pi Key C validator? An official who possesses the authority to conduct and validate Kai C identity documents for others is known as a Pi Kai C validator. How to become a Pi Kai Key validator? To become a Pi Kai validator, you must have completed the Kai K validator. You must have completed the Kai procedure successfully to obtain people's accounts. Finally, if you find this informational film helpful in keeping up with the most recent Pi Network news, please do think about sharing it with the Pi community. Please remember to subscribe to this channel, like, and share. Notice, this video does not fully represent the core team's verified points. Rather, it is based solely on my research and opinions. Always conduct your research, remember?